Today boys, we're bringing you some brand new 41212 custom tactics. Jack's been using them. He clutched up rank 3 last week in foot champs and he got to 2100 skill rating last season in division rivals. Jack, take it away. Yes, Rob. 41212 is back, baby. Honestly, the amount of people last season using 352, they can get out of here, the bloody sweats. Yeah. I think, for me, this plays better than 352. Um... It's a little bit more challenging, I think, but I think the ceiling is higher. So when you get used right. to it, yeah, it is absolutely phenomenal. For high risk, high reward, you could say. Phenomenal. It is, yeah. Um, I think you need good. I think it's we're at the point now in FIFA where I, you need fast players bloody everywhere. Yeah. Um, this is the team we're rocking out with yeah. uh, at the minute. is It's very well built, in my opinion. For Delhi like, Ali instead of De Bruyne, interesting. Yeah. I mean, I love this Deli Alley. He's class. Yeah. Um, I'm a bit fed up with De Bruyne recently. It, you need it's ideal. And Kunku is the type of player that's ideal to be able to go from um, four one two one two and two yeah. to four four two or four triple two or four two three one, etc. Yeah. etc. Et Lads, without further ado, we're going to go into the tactics. Like I said, we are setting up with the four one two two. You want you more kind of so basically, lads. The trick is. You need an attacking fullback, one of them. I have got team right. of the season, Jacques Cancelo, and he is an absolute don. He's like it. the creme de la creme of attacking fullbacks, isn't he, really? Probably about probably the best, to be fair. Yeah. Um, you want some... You want your... The, so, say here, Cancelo is my more attacking one. Mm -hmm. You want Deli Alley, the better defensive one on that side. Right. Uh, in terms of tactics, nothing, nothing too special, lads. It's just 40 width. I want to keep it a little bit more narrow. Um, yeah. Simply due to the fact that you can find that you can you, your centre backs kind of get a bit you know you don't want them too wide because you get that horrible through ball that it always seems to do you in yeah uh, it just does you in. direct passing uh, just for a change and then I play it with one and two Robbie it's really nothing nothing too special there um, no no width being fifty you could probably go for a little bit wider um, like fifty five to be honest actually could be quite nice. Um, Instructions. Now, this is where it gets a little bit more in detail. Nothing too okay. crazy, though. Yeah. Um, because I think we're at the point now where you want to have a certain level of control over your players. Um, Definitely, yeah. If that makes sense, like you, to be able to do RB and LBs and, and all that. So yeah. I've got Ben Yedder just on stay forward. Okay. Um, he's my slower strike. I say slower, he's got 96 pace. Which is crazy, <laughs> and then Mbappe is on stay forward and getting behind. I want him to be stretching that defence. I want him to be... Because basically, when he with him being on getting behind, it draws that over centre-back, gives Ben Yedder some more space, because Ben Yedder's got the best shooting out of the front three. So, yeah, that's that. Stay forward, get into the box for Cantona. Getting into the box is, is optional, but I find that it, it gives him a bit more, you know, a bit more of a rocket up his arse to get into the box. Whereas sometimes he can drift off a little bit. And Kunku, I just leave him on uh, on default. Yeah, uh, I do put him on cover centre though. Yeah, I keep him on cover centre actually. Yeah. Um, Vieira stay back cover centre, and then Dali Ali, I've got on cover centre and stay back. Yeah, um, I think with a narrow formation, it's important to have it as a cover centre. Otherwise, they just they sort of play like a left mid and a right mid, don't they? Which you don't yeah. really want. And you don't want that. No. Um, Deli Alley naturally isn't, you know, you've this type of position here is very good for like a Paqueta, Deli Alley, maybe not De Bruyne so much. I was using Tonali here before. Yeah. Um, it was a shame that he wasn't maybe a little bit better in, in the attack, but it was still really good there, very good option. Yeah. Cancelo, I'd just leave completely on basic. You could yeah. go for overlap if you want, but to be honest with you, there's there's a certain run that's really nice where it's an inverted run where you play it. So say Deli Alley is yeah. up at the top side of your pitch. Jao Cancelo will make that inside run. You can pass it through to him. And, you know, Davies is another good option. Yeah. Uh, Marcelo, Acuna. They've got that great across the shot, uh, yeah. across the keeper shot in the locker. That's what you want. Uh, yeah. Cafu, I do have on uh, stay back. These two just keep on default. Yep. You'd probably have Marquinhos on this side just because Cancelo is going to be running forward a lot more. So you need somebody that's a little bit quicker to cover for him. Yeah. Because you will find yourself exposed. Now, don't get it twisted. You will be wow. exposed down this side. Okay. But I find that what you know, what you get from having them a bit higher up the pitch is absolutely worth it. Allison, yeah. I do have on uh, comes across as and sweeper keeper. Yeah. That's that's it, Rob. It's that say? simple. Yeah. You, you say offense is the best defense, don't they? So you know. Yeah. 
end of the day, uh, you got to score more goals than your opponent, aren't you? Turn into a prime Michael Owen. Um, yes. That's how you win football games. It goes in. It, I'd say it attacks more like a, like a maybe I don't know, maybe like a, a three two. One, two, one. No, but right. basically, like Cam okay. that kind of he, you provide the overloads a lot on that left side. Equally, yeah. if you feel more comfortable attacking down the right, maybe get Danny Alves. Um, Dest would still do quite a good job, to be honest with you, at that side yeah. of the ball. Just something that's really comfortable on the ball. Um, it's very good defensively. To be honest with you, actually, Paqueta would probably do a pretty good job at left back uh, oh. in this role. A bit of a crazy one, but if you're going on untradeable and you. You're struggling to get him in, perhaps yeah. you've got a stack team, you do a good job there. There you are, boys. If you want to see any other formations, anything else, let us know down in the comments. Make sure you follow us on all our social media, Twitch, Instagram, TikTok, Twitter. All that is down below. In the meantime, boys, I've been Robbie. I've been Jack. We've been Backpage Gaming. See you later. See ya. <laughs>